All right, everybody, we're back for another LEGO City review. This is set number 60324. It's the Mobile Crane pieces. Uh, there's 340 of them, and it's a 7 plus set from the City line. And let's get right into it. Move the box. We bought an extra one from my niece. That'll go to her. This is ours. And it has a couple minifigures inside. I'm just going to start by showing that the hook for the crane hooks on here. There's a little hook for it. And we're going to remove that and just move it to the side. And that way we can get into the cabin. There's spots for two people inside the cabin, one on each side. And I'll show you the interior with both roofs off really quick. I love it when they have it big enough to fit two people side by side on any set. And this is a wider set, so it's going to have that. So let's just put these tops back on. I'm gonna remove the other figure from where they sit up here in the control area for the crane. So let's get these two out and all ready to go. Close that back up, put the crane back there, and let's go to the minifigures. Now one thing you'll notice, I've knocked off the tops twice now. They come off a little easily, but I don't think it's a huge deal. So these are our minifigures, both construction workers. This one has, um, let's get that one out of the way. This one has goggles on, construction va uh, construction sweatshirt with a radio in the back. No secondary face. It's fine. Pretty generic and plain looking. And now I'm wondering if those are the right pants. They are the right pants. I didn't think I changed the pants, but those are the right pants. So there's one. And then the second one has orange pants, a scruffy looking face, a work vest, um, and then nothing on the back. Good minifigures, not amazing, but good. I like them, they're fine. I would have maybe liked to see a third minifigure in this set. This set does retail for $40. Um, it is currently on sale on Amazon for 32, I believe. So let's get to the main feature, the set itself. And what I'm gonna do here is just lift it up. Do, perfect. She does on every review. First of all, we have the crane. I already showed you that. Oh, it looks like somebody broke a piece off here. It should have one of these red cylinders here. I forget what they're called. Uh, standoff, I think. Um, it should have one of those there. The other, I'll have them. So I'll show you what happens. It has six wheels, uh, three on each side. These actually come out, boom, and then you lower them, and it does that on both sides with four of these. And they're for stability, because it's a crane and it needs a wider base when it's using its crane at times. So to use the crane, it does spin 360 degrees all the way around. I'm going to show you quickly here. If you want to lock it in place, there is a triangle there and it actually sits right on top of that and that'll help you center it. There's a couple hooks here for radios, brooms, shovels, construction equipment, that kind of stuff, coffee, whatever. Um, there is also, ha, ah, I found it. That was kind of random. Mrs. Butler must have done that. Okay. It does have a license plate on the back. So the crane, you don't lift it up with your hand. What you do is you turn these wheels, that's the wrong one. The front one here, these gears, will lift it up. There's some technic in there and some gears in there to help you do this. It lifts pretty slowly, but I actually really like that, and it's really stable. We were able to lift some heavier stuff with this. Now you have a hook here. It is tied on with a spring. Legos flying everywhere. Oh my goodness. So, let's just fix my phone stand. All right. Yeah, my phone stand is made out of Lego, and that one broke off. So, there you go. The crane is now lifted. It does have a hook here with a string attachment that goes over the top of the boom. Focus. Okay. Now, to get this to move, you use this other gear, and you can actually, you'll see it come into frame here, actually lower the hook all the way down. 
So just to show you, we'll introduce this other plate that it comes with. It has a piece in the middle for that hook to grab onto. You just gotta bring it in just a little bit. Okay. So you see that, and now it just lifts straight up. Um, and you can definitely do this with a bigger road plate, probably too. There's one more trick to this crane, and I'll show you here. I'm gonna just take the uh, plate off. I'm gonna extend the string out, the line out a little bit. And I'm gonna show you one more thing that it does. And that is one-handed here. This extends pretty good distance, actually. I've had it pop out on me. You can kind of see it up there. Okay, that's about as far as I want it to go. So that actually extends out pretty, pretty far. We're gonna go ahead and hook this on. And there you go. You can set your road plate down and do your construction stuff. Let's just set this plate down here and boom, perfect. We'll release and then we'll put her away. Okay, everybody, as you can see, I'm just gonna do a quick kind of wrap around here. Now, that's supposed to be out just for stability. It's a really cool Lego crane. I loved building this. Sometimes you get a set and you just enjoy building it. You know, there's some sets that you enjoy building less than others. This is one of those sets that I actually really just enjoyed building. Um, I, I liked it a lot. So much that we bought a second one, and I've decided to give this to our niece, but I love the set. Um, either way, I give this a 9.5 out of 10. I think if you're, if you're building a Lego city, add this to your collection. It's only $32 right now, $40 normal price. I think this is a great price for $40. Too many figures, maybe I'd like to see a third, but honestly, I think, I think you're okay with just two at, at $40. Um, no complaints here, honestly. So anyways, if you guys like the video, leave a like. If you don't like the video, then leave a dislike. That's, that's what you're supposed to do. Do whatever you want. Um, if you want to see more videos, um, please subscribe and leave a comment if you want to. I'm not, you know, you can leave a comment, give me some advice on how to make better videos if you'd like. However, I'm not like... I'm not looking to make professional quality videos necessarily, so just understand that. Let me just show you the mechanism here a little bit for lowering the crane. Really cool, I think. I like this set a lot. So yeah, leave a like, leave a comment if you want, um, but subscribing is the best way to show me that you actually want to see more videos. Uh, thank you all for watching. This set is great. Go pick it up if you are looking for 40 bucks to spend. See you guys later. Bye.